AI requires an iterative form of development, which is quite different from the way we've historically developed devices. These AI systems are non-deterministic in many cases, or at least they're difficult to inspect and analyze, and so we don't quite know what they'll end up doing. And so what we find is most companies who successfully deploy AI at the edge, they do two things. First, they constantly update their models, and in fact, they do A-B tests on different versions of their models, because until the models are out there in the world, you don't quite know how they'll actually perform. So having solid OT infrastructure that lets you do these A-B tests is really important to deploying AI successfully. The second piece, of course, is you can only do an A-B test if you're collecting data about the performance of your system, right? You need to know how it's doing in the field. So you need some sort of metric data collection system so you can get a clear picture of how that model is working in the field here again because it's somewhat unpredictable. You know, you've characterized it, you've run it in the lab. Of course, you have a good understanding of how the model is going to behave in the field, but you haven't tested every possible input and the AI itself is kind of a black box. And so it's good to have visibility into what actually happens once it's in the field and receiving a much broader set of inputs. You must approach it with an empirical attitude. You can't just assume that it's going to work in the field the same way it does in the lab.